Bismillah ar rahim This video is about toxoplasmosis infection in pregnancy. Toxoplasmosis is caused by an intracellular parasite called Toxoplasma gondii. Infection is transmitted through infected cat feces, undercooked raw meat and transplacentary. Now we will talk about the transmission of toxoplasmosis in the different trimesters. The incidence of transmission in the first trimester is 3 to 9 percent. The incidence of transmission in the third trimester is 60 to 81 percent. It is more lethal in the first trimester as compared to the third trimester. In the first trimester, there is less transmission and it is more lethal at that time. Now we will talk about the screening of toxoplasmosis infection. Various diagnostic methods such as serological, molecular and microscopic tests have been done which can detect the presence of toxoplasma gondii in the donor's blood in order to ensure safety in the recipient blood. But routine and denatal screening is not recommended. Congenital toxoplasmosis is rare and the features of congenital toxoplasmosis include first of all enlarged spleen and liver also called hepatosplenomegaly, jaundice in the newborn, cerebral calcification, chorioretinitis. The incubation period of toxoplasmosis is 5 to 18 days. What are the clinical manifestations of toxoplasmosis in pregnant women? 90% of the women are asymptomatic. Some women may present with flu-like illness or lymphadenopathy. Some may present with fatigue. The other clinical features include encephalitis, pneumonitis, hepatitis in immune compromised women, and myocarditis. The clinical manifestations of toxoplasmosis in the baby include chorioretinitis, hydrocephalus, intracranial calcification, periventricular calcifications, and microcephaly. The most common complication of toxoplasmosis in the first trimester is that of the abortion. In the second trimester, the toxoplasmosis can cause hydrocephalus, microcephaly, seizures, and mental retardation. In the third trimester, usually there are no symptoms except retinochoriditis, which can manifest itself many years after the birth, despite of treatment. With a proven primary infection of the toxoplasmosis, the risk of having affected fetus is highest at 13 to 28 weeks of gestation. How to prevent toxoplasmosis infection? There are various strategies which should be adopted in order to avoid toxoplasmosis. And those include, first of all, avoiding cat. And even if you want to keep the cat, better to clean the cat litter tray daily. The other strategies include washing fruits and vegetables thoroughly, not eating raw meat, regular hand washing, the long-term sequelae of the toxoplasmosis include chorioretinal disease in 85% of the cases, psychomotor disorders, and neurological abnormalities. Now we'll talk about the diagnostic criteria of toxoplasmosis infection. When both IgG and IgM are negative, it means that toxoplasmosis infection is in seronegative state. When both IgG and IgM are positive, and IgG AVDT is low, it means that the toxoplasmosis infection is in acute state. When both IgG and IgM are positive and IgG, IgG AVDT is either borderline or high, it means that the toxoplasmosis infection is in subacute state. When IgG is positive, IgM is negative and IgG AVDT is low, it means that the toxoplasmosis infection is in subacute stage. When IgG is positive, IgM is borderline. IgG, IgG AVDT is either borderline or high, it means that the toxoplasmosis infection is in subacute state. When IgG is positive, IgM is negative, IgG AVDT is high, then it means that the toxoplasmosis infection is in chronic state. For the management of toxoplasmosis infection, different medicines are used, which include first of all spiramycin, pyrimethamine, and sulfadiazine. But it's very important to know that we should avoid pyrimethamine in the third trimester. In severe cases of toxoplasmosis infection, the termination of pregnancy can be done. In the treatment of acute infection of pregnancy, there is 50% reduction of the acute infection of toxoplasmosis. So, thank you so much. That was all about toxoplasmosis infection, its clinical features, preventive strategies, and its management. Subscribe on Officer and Kylie. 
اللہ حافظ